What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to the Thomas Gallery. Today, uh, today I have been temporarily laid off. Let me explain what that means. Now, well, simply what, what it means is for, for about a week, I'll be off because they want to transfer me to a different department. Um, I guess there's this guess business stuff for the most part, and you no, know, I, I ain't I ain't really tripping over it because they're not you know it's not like I don't have a position. It's just they want me in a, in a different different department of where I work. So I get there around one o'clock in the okay, we get around one o'clock in the afternoon because I was told to meet. The manager, supervisor, what do you want to call the position? I'll sort of meet the person in their office so we can discuss where I'm going to be or what's happening, why I'm not going to be in the, uh, the building I was in. Uh oh. Going rain. Oh, anyway. So I get there and I'm told, you know, starting next Monday, I will be in a different building. I asked why. They said, well, you know, uh, what do they call it? They call it, uh, head, they, they said, head count reduction. That simply means we really don't need you at this particular uh, area. So instead of just letting you go, we're going to put you somewhere else because you, you still, I, I do good work. They, they appreciate my work. They enjoy my work. They really like what I do. So they don't want to get rid of me. So they said, well, we'll just transfer you to a different area. So, okay. So starting, it said starting Monday, starting Monday, that's going to be happening. Now, and my schedule is going to be is, I'm going to go through, a, it said we're going to go through a month's training Starting in the morning, it's gonna be in the morning. We train it for a month, so I'm like, okay, what do they what do they have me doing that requires me to train for a month? Excuse me. So it's like okay. So I call my wife, ask her to come pick me back up, because I'm thinking, okay, I'm thinking, because from what I was told last week, that I was gonna be working today. But when I got to the meeting, that whole thing switched up. They're going to have me at a different... They said, I'm not working today. So that was my last day. Even though that's not what was said during the first time we met about this. So there's a couple of things I'm a bit confused about, to be honest with you. There's a couple of flags that popped up in my head. They got me thinking... Let me think of some thoughts, but you know, it's business, but just some things that pop up in my mind that I have questions about that at the moment I didn't have time to answer, I didn't have time to ask. So as the time goes on, I'm gonna ask these questions and try to get some answer to these questions to see what my next move is, so. But yeah, so for the time being, for, so for, for this whole week, for this entire week, technically I'm laid off. So, you know, technically I'm laid off for this week. And Monday, I'll be back in full effect, you know. But yeah, it was crazy. I'm like, they could have told me this over the phone but they wanted to they wanted to um, change some of the information on my I guess my sheet thing or something like that so the two it won't, it won't be any confusion between the two buildings as to where I'm going and who's going to be expecting me so yeah but crazy 
I was like, cause my wife dropped me off at, at, um, at work. Had a little meeting. The meeting was about maybe 15 minutes. The meeting was about 15 minutes long. And it's like, okay, now I gotta call my wife. I could come back so she can come get me because she don't know that that's an ice cream truck going on. She don't know what's going on. I mean, she basically knew what I knew. And last week, I really didn't know much of anything, so it wasn't much I could tell her. But I now know. So I was like, see see where things going, see, you know, see if I got if I gotta readjust some things on my schedule. Because you no know, I can't just up and just you know switch like that. You know, I gotta make sure everything at home is taken care of where it won't be a hindrance to anybody and I can still proceed if Everything, everything is good, like I hope it is. But yeah, it's crazy stuff, man. Crazy stuff. I was like, I was like, wow. It's like it was much better if you'd have just called me on the phone, but I, that I had to be there because I had to uh, return some stuff and get some new stuff back and all that. So, so like I said, that's, that's the only reason. That's the only, that's the only reason why I had to be at the actual building was because I had to, you know, exchange some things with a manager. Now that it was all done, I'm off until next week. I'm off until next Monday. Hey, so yeah, like I said, the training, whatever, I don't like, I don't know what training is going to be because the training I had when I first started working there, it wasn't for a whole week. It may be like, it was like maybe two days, I think, maybe two days, if that, maybe a day, day and a half, something like that. So I'm curious to what, what task am I going to be given that requires me to train for an entire month? Because I, because I've been in both buildings, and I'm like, okay, what job here is so complicated or so intricate, so detailed? so finely tuned that it requires an entire month usually i from what i've always learned and what i've always seen jobs that require a month's training always sounded like some kind of like some managerial position some high up position something like you like going on like like a like a retreat or something but to me not like for no I don't want to say low level, but it's the only way I can think of some low level skill. Like, I don't know. I don't know. I wanted to ask these questions, but I didn't have the time because she, because my the manager had to go somewhere, and I had to call my wife to come ask to come get come back and get me. So, say so I'm curious about that. I'm curious about that. I don't know really what to expect. I don't know why, we, and now I, I don't know what to expect for real. And I don't know how long this is going to be because I've only been at the, 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 my, the, my previous position for a week, like literally a week. If actually, you know what? No, like two, about two weeks. Well, like two weeks I've been there. And two weeks I've been there and already there taking me off that assignment and put me somewhere that requires a month's worth of training. So like, like what like what could it be? Like what could it be that requires a month of training? Like, I, I don't like I'm, I'm I'm thinking that if it was gonna be some kind of like some kind of managerial job, then they would have told me that hey, we seen you, you know, we see how, how you do, we like what you do. There's a managerial position we want to put you in. I that like like I say anytime I've seen anytime I've heard about um, like a managerial like anytime I heard about like a month's training, it's always like some kind of retreat you go on or some kind of like high end position. So I'm thinking, there's no way it could be a high end position or some kind of retreat that they're gonna put me in because I've only been there for two weeks. 
I ain't been there for two weeks, so how you gonna get somebody who been there for two weeks a month worth of training for a high level position? I don't think it's gonna be happening. So I'm like, what could it be? What could it possibly be that will require a month's worth of training? Like, I, this, this, has been, this has been boggling my mind for the longest time, so. But I'm gonna I'm I'm call, I'm 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 call and ask, you know, the, the question that the questions that I couldn't ask that I didn't get a chance to ask um, when I met when I met when I met my manager, I'm a, during the during this break I'ma ask them, I'ma ask to see what they say, which will either make my decision better or worse. So we're gonna find out. We're gonna find out. Thank you all for listening. Leave a comment down below. Like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I'll catch you all later. Peace.